Hey friends, so here I have six red wines in front of me and they're all different. They may all look the same, but they're all different. Now, if I were to try and describe them to you in a true master of wine style, you might accuse me of being too technical and too theoretical. So I thought, why not have some fun, make this easy and relatable by looking at different wine styles through the lens of a woman's personality. So here we go. So first up in my glass is a Cabernet Sauvignon, the most high profile of them all. Think of this wine as a lady who you meet if you go to a social soiree, a pretty high-end one, and this particular woman walks in, she's fashionably dressed, she's probably wearing designer clothes, she's someone you know who's well-traveled and uh, throws some of the biggest parties at home, biggest, you know, most uh, talked about soirees at home. She's somebody who is, of course, she's sophisticated, uh, but at the same time, she's someone who's a bit hoity-toity. Do you know a woman like that? That's a Cabernet Sauvignon woman for you. So where at one end we have the Cabernet Sauvignon as this high profile woman you know, Merlot at the other end is this warm, comforting, wonderful partner or friend that you have. Someone who's very reliable, someone who you can tell all your dirty secrets to but won't judge you, will still love you for who you are and will always reliably turn up for all your good and your bad times. That's Merlot for you because Merlot is always enjoyable, always, almost always delicious and Merlot is your all season best time buddy. Next up is Sira, the forthright lady. She's somebody who always speaks her mind. She does not mince her words. So one thing you can always rely on her for is absolute honesty. Sometimes she'll floor you with sweet complimenting words, but at other times she will show you the mirror and tell you like it is. And you might find her words spicy and sometimes hard to take. She can be cutting as well with her words. But like I said, one thing that you can always know is she's telling you the truth for your good. And now, think of Pinot Noir as the most charming, gracious, elegant lady that you know in your life. A Pinot Noir is somebody who's always politically correct, well-mannered, likes everything to be prim and proper. Even when she hosts parties, she's most gracious, both with her words as well as her hospitality. Pinot Noir is the epitome of graciousness and elegance. So who do you know in your life that's like a Pinot Noir? I'm wondering if you are the Sangiovese lady, confident, very comfortable in your own skin, always self-assertive and somebody who has an invigorating personality but at the same time is also very intriguing has many complex layers and you know sometimes can be moody one day you're full on and at other days you're more reticent and you're thinking your plans you are someone who's very ambitious and you have great plans sometimes you can also be a bit of a rebel that's the perfect Sangiovese lady for you. And finally, we have the Zinfandel lady. I like to refer to them as the wild one, the untamed one. This is a woman who loves to live life on her own terms. She draws up her own rules and you can't tell her what to do. She's highly unpredictable. So some days she blows hot, on other days she blows cold. Wild, wacky, always super enjoyable but sometimes can be a bit overwhelming and too hot to handle that's your zinfandel woman i know you've related to at least one or more types of red wines even while i was speaking so here's what i want you to do comment below with which red wine you think you are and also tag some of your favorite women telling them which red wine you think they are how much fun is that guys and also my dear friends don't forget to share this video, share the love, share the joy, share the fun. Cheers for now.